Hey guys, it is Saturday, um, 7th of July, and I thought today I would kind of give you a quick little haul because I've got a stamp camp that's going to be happening today here in the camper, and um, so I got a couple things for that, and I got two other hauls to show you. I've got the stamp camp one right here. Um, I've got a little bit of a Hobby Lobby, a little bit of Etsy, and a little tiny one for um, Amazon. So I thought that I would share that with you while I was sitting here. Um, surgery is coming up in uh, four days. Five days? Let's see. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So four days. So I'm trying to get everything organized for that so that I don't have to do a whole lot afterwards. Um, and really that's all that's going on. I've got, like I said, a stamp camp happening today here in the camper. Just a small group, and I prefer small groups. Um, I feel like more gets done, if that makes any sense. Um, and I feel like I'm able to do more one-on-one. -on -one, so, that's anyway, that's happening today. I have, like I said, the Stampin' Up! one we'll do first. And it's, again, it's not a very big haul, but it's enough. I got the stamp set that's called All the Good Things. And you'll notice that the Stampin' Up! changed their packaging um, to most everything. And I'm sure if you watch any Stampin' Up! videos, you've seen that before. But this is one six no one four six five five eight. It's called All the Good Things, and I liked it because I really like this koi fish, and I like the saying, and it says, um, "No act of kindness, no matter how small, is ever wasted." I like that a lot. So I got the stamp set. I've got two cards in mind for that. I got Sweet Storybook, and it is one four six five one one, and it's flipping adorable. There's so much, so much adorable happening here. Um, it's got the two-step stamping on two of the cards, or, or not two of the cards, two of the stamps, or you can do it without and just color it in, or whatever. Um, and there's one that says, did I ever tell you you're wonderful? And I like that a lot. So I got this. Isn't that cute? That is super cute. Um, not really my style or anything. I much prefer more this style rather than cartoony, but it's still cute. I like it. And then I got uh, Itty Bitty Greetings, and it's a two, two, uh, it comes in two cases. And it's got, its number is 146667, and it's called Itty Bitty Greetings, and it's got a ton of greetings. It's got love and sympathy, many, you're engaged, I love you, many thanks, Easter blessings, a little hello, tis the season, happy. Mother's Day with gratitude, just on and on and on. Happy birthday, happy graduation, congratulations. And they're small, so they fit on little bitty banners and stuff, or small cards like 3 by 3s or something um, that you might give with flowers or such. So, or tags or something, so I got that. Love that. And then I got two more colors. So I got the reinkers, the stamp pad, and the um, paper. I got Mossy Meadow and Poppy Parade. I'm kind of bummed because I just finally got my whole collection complete and they changed colors on me, so I got those. There's that. So there. I got all that. Let me throw this stuff in the box and set it aside. And I know for sure we're going to be using Itty Bitty Greetings at the Stamp Camp. Um, so, yay! I'm excited. I'm really looking forward to it. Okay, so, got those out of the way. Alright, so then, on Amazon, I wanted, I didn't need, but I wanted another, um, uh, watercolor set because I just love collecting watercolor sets, apparently. Um, and this one came with the brush, and I like that a lot. But it also, if you... You can fan them out. And 
and work with them on a table. I think the point of it is so that you can watercolor while you're out and about, um, and that it fits in a very small container. But that's pretty cool. I like it. And it's the pans are okay. They're not gigantic. I think that they would work out to about a quarter pan if they were in a pan, about a quarter um, ish. That's something there. Um, I like it. I thought it was fun. I thought it was cute. Uh, and it says Superior here, but I don't think that's the brand that said that I can't read anything about it because it's all in a foreign language that I don't know how to read. So, but I really like it. I think it'll make travel pretty easy. The only thing that concerns me is if, say, this paint is wet and I slide this on top, isn't that going to move the wet paint? I don't know if you can see what I'm saying. If this pan is wet here and I slide this in place to put it away, isn't that going to move wet paint and slide it? I don't know. I'm, it's all right. Pretty happy with it anyway. And so at Hobby Lobby, I picked up some wax seals. Now I've got a set somewhere in the house and I don't know what happened to it. I have a feeling, but this has got the, uh, two gold and the silver uh, wax, uh, and then it's got the two seals. It's got a little crown and a fleur de -lis and the little handle, and you can um, switch back and forth. I like it. It's cute. And I didn't pay the $12.99. I used my 40% off. And then I got two more um, in copper and one more in white of the wax sticks. And I had to get copper, because my favorite is copper. And then from Etsy, I got this. And this took a billion years to get here. It took six weeks to get here. Um, and this wax seal is pine cones, because I love pine cones. And it's really hard to see, but... Um, and then I got, it came with two... It came with four colors. One's a like an antique gold, one's a gold, one's more of a yellowy gold, and one's a copper. Well, this might be more of a greenish color. It's kind of hard to tell depending on the light. It kind of looks a little different. So I got these wax seals as well. I just need a spoon to uh, melt in. But yeah, so that's my little bitty haul. Um, kind of excited. In fact, I'm really excited about the pine cone. Um, I wanted something pine cone related uh, for a wax seal and just happened to find it on Etsy one day, just randomly. Um, so I guess that is just about it for my haul. Like I said, later on this week I've got my surgery coming, so I want to get things done ahead of that. I've got the stamp camp happening today. Um, said it's going to be a very small group. And that is pretty much everything. So I shall let you go for now. Uh, have a great week and we shall talk to you later. I do have more stuff on the way. Uh, more stamping up. I got to do a pre-order. So that's some stuff that's going to be kind of a sneak peek also. Um, I think as soon as I have it in my hands, I'm about to show it, though, so we'll see. And then, what else do I have coming? Some books. I think that's it. Anyway, we shall talk to you later. Bye. Uh, but that should be my ex- my- not my intro, but my outro theme song is awkward, awkward, awkward. Bye.